starting off shooting, I had a fairly cheap bipod that I bought from a local large box store. Um, and when I had that on my rifle, I thought it was all fine and everything was good until you start shooting competition, you start testing your gear a little bit more. It is from when you transition from, you know, I went to go shoot a couple times to I'm becoming serious about I wanna improve. Like now you don't want to be held back anymore. It's a little bit more modular, a little bit better set up for uh, rapid positioning. Just makes it easier to get comfortable and get stable in very unstable positions. So it is, it's the transition between I've been shooting a few times to I'm going to try a competition now. Um, the bit of a lighter weight is really nice. Uh, if you're going to be you know, walking around in the woods for a full day, um, climbing up a mountain, something like that, a little bit lighter weight always helps. Um, or if you're running it on a three gun or AR type setup, uh, multi gun, something where you're moving around pretty quick and you're uh, having to deploy your bipod on the clock um, or deploy pretty quickly, then the ground pod is, is gonna be really handy for that. Four positions of leg locking angle. You've got your fully stowed position, your 50 degree deployed, 90 degree, and then back up at 180. You've also got one handed operation, so you can reach forward, hit a button, move the, move the legs to position, let go. You also just grab onto the leg and pull down on it. You don't actually have to hit any buttons or any mechanisms to, to deploy the legs. Interchangeable feet, so it'll fit with the Atlas feet uh, or Skypod feet. You have spike feet in there if you want. We've got Picatinny and Arca or RRS dovetail compatible. So you've got the two different options there. We've also got toolless cant uh, adjustment. So unlike some of the other bipods in that price range where you've got to reach forward and there's a little knob to adjust the cant tension, this one just comes out of the box with a, a throw lever on it, um, so you can't adjust there. Height range is pretty good as well. You're all the way down to about four and a half inches up to about nine, so pretty good uh, travel on it. Through development of the ground pod, um, we did a ton of different testing. Uh, we did some empirical testing where we actually took the bipod samples and the prototypes and dropped them and tried to destroy them and did like real world destructive testing on them. We wanted to ensure that even if you dropped it down with a 20 pound gun, it wouldn't break on you, wouldn't give out. Um, or even heavier still. So we, we definitely over-designed the legs a lot. And then when we got the samples in, we tested the crap out of them. If somebody that wants to just have a good solid bipod that isn't stable for them, then this is a great unit.